Fernando is particularly proud of his billy goat. It's clearly the dominant animal in the small herd that scrabbles for feed in the stony paddock at the far southern edge of Catalonia. Today, the farmer is feeding his goats and sheep wearing a Barcelona FC jersey. Fernando poses Independence Image 9 News Michael Best It's the soccer side that supports the independence referendum that Spain declared illegal, and Catalonia's regional government may soon use to justify a declaration of independence. Fernando lives in the town of San Rafael del Rio which straddles the region border between Catalonia and Valencia. If Catalonia becomes an independent nation, the bridge that runs through the center of town would become an international border. Fernando lives on the Catalan side, but he doesn't support independence. He says the region is too small to make it work and reckons had moved to Valencia if independence was declared, because it would be better for his sheep. The town of San Rafael del Rio straddles the border between Catalonia and Valencia. Image 9 News Michael Best as Independence D-Day approaches, it feels like people who are worried about splitting from Spain are becoming more vocal. Certainly, both the legalities and logistics are mind-boggling. Spain has an army, navy, air force, and national police which are far better equipped than the Catalan police officers. Its constitution also says any independence declaration would be illegal, leaving any instigators open to charges of sedition. The EU is certainly backing Spain. Now, even Barcelona's mayor is backing away urging dialogue, so what now? As pressure mounts independence may seem increasingly unlikely, though the passion and culture of the Catalans can't be underestimated. Fernando says he'd blow up the bridge through his town if an independent Catalonia went ahead. He was laughing when he said it though. At least someone is. Copyright 9 Digital Tie Limited 2017